juice. I ain't gonna say I wish we had social media back when I was in junior high school. I do have one teacher I felt as though. We know she had the yams, but we ain't never really got to see the yams because we ain't had no Facebook or no Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Y'all young boys don't understand how how, how lucky y'all are because now y'all teachers just be on the internet exposing yourselves. <laughs> I'm just, I was going to say something, but I'm, I'm going to keep that to myself. If he ain't paying all them bills, he can't say nothing, okay? Nothing, because he's just a roommate, okay? So you, as a woman, if you're married, single, whatever, if your man is not paying every bill in that house, do whatever you want, okay? He don't run nothing up in there, okay? Just so you know, unless he's paying every single bill in every one of your bills, he doesn't run anything anything stop caring so much if he doesn't like you wearing a certain thing put that thing on and walk out if he doesn't like you wearing weave and makeup put the weave and makeup on and... I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till after the video. Walk out. If you don't like you getting nails done this long or with like red nail polish on it, get your nails red and long. If he doesn't like you uh, wearing certain types of clothing or shoes, put them on. Walk around and like you don't run nothing over here. Okay. I don't like when you do A, B, C, and D. So I guess it's okay because you do it. I don't like. So I'm gonna do exactly what you don't like. I'm going to walk around here looking like this and these heels and this dress and this makeup and this hair and these nails. And guess what? Oh, I have to go have dinner with my friend, uh, my sister. I'll be back. Oh, you know, text me later. Then don't answer. Hold on. Did y'all catch that? I have to go have dinner with my friend, uh, my sister. I'll be back. Yo, bro. I'm... Mm. I'm trying to make it through this video. I'm trying to make it through this video. Through. Just walk out. Where are you going? I don't, I don't, I don't. Oh, no, it's just girls. Oh, it's just business. Or, oh, it's just... If he ain't paying all them bills, he can't say nothing. Okay? Nothing, because he's just a roommate. Okay? So, you as a... I'm doing my best to not really give relationship advice on the internet because you know I'm not I'm not professionally qualified. I'm not a psychologist. I'm not a relationship guru. I can only go based on my experiences, based on, you know, when I was single, I moved this way. Now that I'm married, I have to move this way. You know what I'm saying? But what I can say is that women like this, women like this do not attract me. I hope that if you have the means to buy and spoil a lady, your lady, make sure that she deserves it. Make sure that she's not with you only because you can spoil her. I want somebody who's going to laugh at my jokes because it's actually funny. And based on the things she's saying, like, if he doesn't pay all your bills, he's a roommate. Imagine that. You with somebody, you taking care of them, you know, put a roof over their head, make sure they're comfortable, and you fall on hard times because shit happens believe it or not one day you up tomorrow you might be down and they leave you because you can no longer provide that lifestyle for them i listen to a lot of the, the red pill channels and the information they, they tell you is yeah make money women will come but to be honest 
Do you want the women that come after you make money? Like, ask yourself that. Do you want the women that come after you make money? I don't want to come out here and start preaching to y'all. It's a lot of dudes out here who get money and they out here looking for girlfriends and wives, but it's like they shopping for Gucci bags. The amount of money I have got to be represented by her looks. I can afford her. I can afford a bad bitch. My thing, right? My thing is, if I'm dating and I'm thinking of really like getting serious with you, I'm going to ask myself this question. If I go out there and I get in an accident, and God forbid I, I can't control my bowel movements, I start shitting myself, how long are you going to stay with me and wipe my ass before you leave? Do I see this woman wiping my ass? I would not date a woman that simply want me because of what I can provide. I want you to earn the right of me paying the bills, me spoiling you. You have to earn that. Just because you have some pussy between your legs, that don't give you the right. You're not entitled to me doing for you unless you earn it. Me and my wife been together for a long time, bro. And she has earned the right for me to pay the bills, all the bills. She have earned the right for me to take care of her and spoil her. And it was a point in time where I couldn't do that. But she didn't leave me. She didn't make me feel like the roommate. You feel what I'm saying? Like a few months ago, bro, a few months ago, my job was working 32 hours. My YouTube was struggling. My savings was up out of there. She had to hold it down. She had to hold it down, bro. And as a man, I didn't even feel right. The crazy thing, the fact that I'm even like admitting this shit to y'all is, is crazy. As a man, I ain't feel right. My wife... Is holding it down for me. And then on top of that, my wife has a successful business. So that's a double whammy. It's like, bro, what you doing? What you doing with yourself? But she held it down. She held it down because she genuinely had love for me. And I respect that. So now, YouTube's doing good. I have an okay job. You know what I'm saying? I have little side hustles that's actually bringing in a lot of money. So, you know... Now that I'm a six-figure, I ain't trying to brag, but I'm really happy about that. My wife has earned the right for me to do all those things. Everything that she's talking about, my wife has earned the right for that. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm going to be real with you. What she's describing is a high-value simp. She's describing a high-value simp. It's a study that shows that like um, high-value men get cheated on the most, believe it or not. Now, I'm not saying anything wrong with being a high-value man, but if you're going to be a high-value man, make sure you, you know what I'm saying, you got something else to offer. And make, matter of fact, fuck all that. Make sure the women that you choose are right for you. Women like her are not right for you. Women like her deserve to be single. That's just real. Women like her deserve to be alone. Because they only out here to use. She's not adding any value to your life. Remember, I don't know if y'all saw the last video I did where Shorty was describing uh, what it is to, to keep a bad b Same thing. An expensive-ass car that doesn't add no value to your life. Why you want that? It's a depreciating value. I've never, yo, I've never been the type. I've never been the type to go for chicks that's only with me be based on like, oh, he getting some money, he getting to the bag. Like, no. You feel what I'm saying? La laugh at my jokes because I'm genuinely funny. Laugh at my jokes because you think I'm genuinely funny. Have a conversation with me because you genuinely care about what I got to say. Let's vibe. I'm, I'm all about the vibe, bro. I don't care. May maybe that's some blue pill shit. I don't know how, how y'all feel about it. I'd rather be with somebody that I vibes with. Let's build something together. I always believe that I'm going to be straight no matter what. I'm going to be all right no matter what. Even if we having bad times right now, I know that shit going to get better. I used to always tell my wife that. I'm like, yo, it's going to be good. I got you. I got you. You don't got to stress. I got you. And you know what? I got her. And I can admit that shit. Like, I, I wasn't no high value, man. Like, I wasn't, no, I wasn't making that type of bread to where, like, I can spoil her and let's do this, let's do that. I wasn't doing none of that. But she still stayed. The worst thing you can do is have a baby with a woman that's only in it for financial gain. That baby is an investment for her to secure the bag. She don't really like you like that. 
She ain't feeling you like that. Go get you a genuine ass female that's with you for you. 